Hi, after the screencast you'll know how to use iTunes to convert a WAV file to an MP3 file. Here's my WAV file. The, my first step is going to be to get it into iTunes. So I'm just going to drag it into the iTunes application. And I'll switch to iTunes. You'll see it shows the WAV file. Now why would I want to do this? Well, in some cases an MP3 player will not play a WAV file or you'll just want an MP3 for other reasons. By default, if I go to Advanced menu, well first I have to select the file and then click Advanced. The default format for iTunes is AAC. This is a more advanced format that was meant to replace MP3 and maybe over time it will, but for now MP3 is still commonly used. So I'm going to go to my iTunes Preferences and you'll see that there's import settings. Now it says when you insert a CD, ask to import CD, and then this is what it's going to convert those tracks to when they're imported. So I'll click in import settings and I'm going to change AAC encoder to MP3 encoder. And I'll go ahead and leave high quality. You can change that depending on how much space you want it to take. But I'm going to go with the default. Okay, so now I close out of the preferences and now you'll notice if I click advanced the option has changed from create AAC version to create MP3 version so I'm gonna do that and voila here's my MP3 version of the sound now if I right click on it and on a Mac it says show in finder I think on Apple's or on Windows it would say show in Explorer you'll see I have now an mp3 version of my file and from here I could take that and put it on my mp3 player for example or use it for whatever application needs an mp3 file rather than a WAV file. Thanks!